hi guys thank you so much for tuning in today i'm glad to see you back on my channel so today's video is going to be about newborn essentials um, essentials in my opinion but before i start this video i would like to uh, talk to you about the sponsor for this video which is the brand uh this year perfumes i worked with them before and absolutely adore their brand uh, so they sent me this package with a new uh scent the the scent that i picked is uh gourmet orange blossom this is how the packaging looks like when you open it um it says iconic sense designer quality no markups so the each bottle is about 30 dollars which is much more affordable than the scents that you find in the store plus if you have some favorite scents um like a name brand sense you can go to dasia.com website and find something similar they have like a inspiration inspired by so you can find something very similar for a fracture of the coast but they always run different promotions uh like the more you buy more basically you save uh buying two or three bottles will uh, save you a certain uh, amount um so this particular scent the notes are orange blossom uh blackcurrant and hazelnut and there is also middle notes and the base notes um so what I love about this brand that these perfumes are made in France, they're cruelty free and they're vegan. So this is how the bottle looks like. What I also love, it's a very heavy glass, very high quality. It's about 50 milliliters in it. And uh, again, you get it for a fraction of the price of large perfumes like this, large bottles like this. And I love the cap. It's a very um, high quality uh, magnetic cap. So it won't spill if you want to take it with you and what i love about it that this is like a super fine mist and it also stays this oh, it's really good so you it really stays with you all day so um it doesn't wear off very uh, fast like some perfumes do so yeah i'll post the link down below with my discount code if you want to check them out please go right ahead because i absolutely love this brand and i'm sure you will as well so today I would like to talk to you about uh, newborn essentials. It's all the items that I absolutely love using for the babies from zero to three months. As you all know, I have um, a five-year-old twin boys and I have a newborn baby who is um, about seven weeks right now. So we using a lot of these products. I've been using them, like a lot of these items I've been using with my twins five years ago. And I also have quite a few new items. But I will tell you about my favorite brands, um, just, you know, why I love them and things like that and different types of products. So I understand that essentials are pretty much, um, you know, one, two or three items that baby absolutely need. Babies just need a safe place to sleep. Uh, they need you as a mom or parent and then they need something to eat. So um, I understand that this is a lot of extras and a lot of... Uh, unnecessary stuff but this is definitely items that made my life much easier and I feel like they made my baby feel much more comfortable as well so I want so I broke them down in kind of a, like a categories so the first category is like keeping baby clean basically um, so uh, number one item in our household right now is probably these uh, diapers so my favorite brand is Huggies and specifically I like this little snugglers I use them um, with my twins and I'm using with the baby and I noticed that the hospital we were in also using the same brand specifically these little snugglers are very very soft and cozy for the baby they also have like little movers and things you know different types um, specifically little snugglers are my favorite so this is the size two because i just got um a few boxes oh, because i got a few boxes uh in advance um but i uh suggest you to get only one box of newborn diapers because they outgrow them very very soon newborn um size is up to 10 pounds i believe and i know a lot of babies are born at eight or nine pounds and you know kind of will outgrow the size very soon um but again every store pretty much if you if your baby is outgrowing uh, diapers and you have an open box you can return it to pretty much um the store that you bought and exchange it for a bigger size okay so the next item that you definitely will need for the baby is uh, wipes and my favorites are water wipes uh just because they're 
uh, very good for sensitive skin of newborn babies and they uh, they have 99.9 percent .9 of water um, again they're a little bit more on expensive side so my second choice is Huggies sensitive wipes they're a little bit more affordable but again if you don't mind spending a little bit extra this is my favorite so for the diaper rash that all babies get once in a while this is a really good cream it's called calmosif i don't know if i pronounced it right so tara got me this uh diaper rash cream and it really works like a magic every time you just put on like a slight bit it the diaper rash goes away very very fast another item i wanted to show you is this um wipe warmer this one by brand go go pure i got it on amazon and what i love about them that there are two settings make them a little bit cooler and a little bit warmer i always use it warmer setting this button kind of easy like accidentally hit it sometimes and it goes down to the uh less temperature setting i don't like that the location of this button but what i like uh about this um wipe warmer is that it has a night light so you just press the button and it makes you know makes nighttime changes very super uh make a nighttime diaper changes super easy but this night light doesn't stay on the whole night i had another uh, I believe by Munchkin, I had another wipe warmer from Target and I didn't like it because the night light was staying on the whole night and it was like a cool blue light. I didn't really like it. So I love this one. And again, this is not necessary. I know a lot of people uh, don't use wipe warmers, but I know my baby was crying a lot every time I was changing her with the cold wipes. And once we got this one, it made her feel much more comfortable. Sometimes I can uh, change her uh, like at night without even waking her up just because the wipes are so warm um, and I use wipe warmers with my kids as well uh, so for for us it's definitely worth it and for the last item for uh, like a diaper changing um, I wanted to tell you what diaper pail I've been using so we've been using the ubi I believe it's called so this is how it looks and what I love about it is that you don't have to buy specific uh bags for it so it fits standard 13 gallon kitchen bags which saves you in the long run but this one is a little bit more pricey i believe it's 79 bucks you can wait for sale for bye bye baby and get like 20 percent off coupon and they have different colors so it fits any nursery but i've been living this diaper pail just for the purpose of saving on the refills i don't have to buy specific refills i can just put the kitchen bags in there so the next category i would like to talk to you about is feeding of the baby so i'm exclusively breastfeeding so in my uh case i definitely need some kind of baby scale i just purchased um like old brand babies are us the used scale just so i can keep a track of how much baby ate and how much uh weight the baby gains every week so definitely need a scale and also i'm using this haka um manual pump so when i'm feeding baby on one side uh, in the morning, for example, I put hack on the other so uh, it catches all the letdowns or sometimes if the baby doesn't wake up uh, for a few hours in the middle of the night, I can use this just to, you know, relieve the engorgement basically. Um, so this has been very, very helpful. Um, also for the feeding of the baby, I love this Comatoma bottles uh, because my baby has been a little bit gassy. We tried another brand which was like Mam. Uh, Mam uh bottles and the nipple which was the newborn zero nipple was still too fast for her so what i love about this one um the nipple for newborns if you buy small small bottles it come with the newborn nipples um you can see um how much basically milk you put in there and it has this two little vents on the side so it's supposed to help baby not to get too much um colics after drinking this uh from this bottle and things like that it, it helps with like venting i don't know i don't know what i'm trying to say i hope you understand so it's supposed to help with uh colics and it's also very squishy and soft so it helps baby to like it, it helps mimic the actual breastfeeding so the baby wouldn't get confused between natural between the actual thing and the bottle and also i wanted to try i know the nano bb has something similar uh they have a newer bottle so i'm gonna try those as well 
um also speaking of colex i've been really liking this gripe water we discovered it for the twins they also had colex when they were little so this gripe water really good for helping them with hiccups and with colex and like release some gas and just you know reflux and things like that and also for the feeding i absolutely love this nursing pillow uh, especially because i have shorter arms so um I definitely need to have baby like lifted up a little bit to be comfortable i know a lot of people use boppy pillow but i love this pillow is by docket uh with this marble cover first of all it's like very velvety very soft and the second of all um i love it because it's a little bit less squishy than boppy so it's a little bit more um sturdy i would say and this shape is really comfortable to use in the chairs and actually been really good for um feeding baby on the go when i take baby in my car um it's very comfortable to put this like when i'm feeding her basically on the passenger seat or on the driver's seat i just put this on my lap and i fit her um because it's not as bulky as like a a bobby for example and also as far as burping cloths because you will definitely need burp, burp cloths so um this is my favorite i got them on amazon and what i love about them that there are like several layers inside so nothing really leaks because we had before like a very thin um burp cloths but i feel like this definitely catch much more so if the baby has accident and like froze up on you or whatever can happen this burp cloths will definitely help okay so the next category is going to be kind of like a miscellaneous and things just to make a uh, baby feel more comfortable so uh, i think very important to have a pacifier and my favorites uh my favorite pacifier for baby is this event um uh, pacifier but they always fall out of her mouth when she's sleeping or when she's like in a stroller so i got this thing um i'll post it down below i got it from target i believe every store has it pretty much um so because of this toy it kind of weighs the pacifier down it's kind of like a, a hand that's holding the pacifier so it keeps it keeps pacifier in baby's mouth a little bit longer so i've been loving this as far as the clothes go, I don't really have much clothes for the baby. I noticed that my baby mainly wears pajamas with the zipper and that's all I really need. So I only got three pajamas of each size. So this one is three to six months because she's already kind of outgrowing her um, zero to three months uh, pajamas. They all have uh, two-way zippers so you can unzip them from the bottom and change her in the middle of the night. So this is, um, I absolutely love Carter's because of their... You know they're cute and they're super comfortable and i like i love their quality and i also have a uh, free short sleeve onesies for the times when um i don't know for the warmer days basically but we almost always wear um the long sleeves pajamas with the zippers and as far as uh wraps go because my baby loves to be wrapped she doesn't like to be wrapped all day all night but sometimes i feel like when she has hard times falling asleep and when i wrap her it combs her right um uh, it calms her right down and she feels just very secure and snug and i feel it's kind of a part of a nighttime routine so um i've been loving this um it's like a velcro um the brand is swaddle me velcro swaddle but this specifically one uh this but this specific one has a zipper on the bottom so again if you're going to change your baby at night without waking her up you can just unzip her from the bottom you don't need to open it up because this velcro is very loud so if you open it you're definitely going to wake up the baby um, and we used to love the swaddles for the twins as well, but they didn't have zipper back then on the on the bottom. And then the second option, so sometimes the swaddles don't wa uh, don't work. They're pretty snug, so she doesn't get out of them much. But the one I want something a little bit softer for her. I just have this. Um, it's a very stretchy material. It's like a blend of polyester and cotton and uh, rayon, I believe. So this is just a swaddle that I just do like I swaddle her manually. And this is really good on the go because I can also use it as a, a stroller cover. I can use it as her blanket. I can use it as the nursing cover. So it's, you know, it works for all kind of things. 
Okay, another thing that's very important for me, at least in my household, is the carriers. So my favorite one is this carrier. Uh, this is just a random brand from Amazon. They have all kind of uh, wraps like this. It's a little bit complicated to put it on, but once you figure out, it's super easy and you can feed the baby um, when the baby is laying in this cover as well. Again, it baby feels very cozy, especially if it's a newborn and the baby is so close to you. Uh, so this has been um, one of my favorite and I also used it for my twins. But if you are a fan of uh, structured wraps, this is my second favorite. This is by Ergo Baby. Um, Ergo Baby Embrace. So I love this jersey fabric, it's super soft. And again, it's very easy to put on. It has like a crisscross uh, straps on the back and this goes on your shoulders. So you definitely have like support, really good support for your back. So very comfortable, super easy to put on. So this is my go-to when I'm out and about and I just need to put it on super quickly. So the next thing I would like to talk to you about is this uh, Dock it out. When I'm able to lay her down, I feel like uh, the cushion like this, they have a different brands, but um, I absolutely love Dock it out just because of the beautiful cover and the quality. So when I'm, I need some place to lay her down safely, I can always count on this little thing and I can uh, move her on a couch or on the bed and take, take her to the living room and just, you know, so she hangs out with us. And uh, Mai has this little toy section i don't know how to call it she doesn't really care for it much yet but i know, feel like within the next month or so she will really like that and yeah and it has a removable cover so you can wash it another thing that i have been loving is this this is the investment piece so this is the bassinet by happiest baby so this is a snoop bassinet my baby uh really enjoyed it like a first week when i got it just because she likes when i rock her to sleep but when i place her somewhere she wakes right back up because this bassinet rocks back and back and forth it kind of keeps her asleep uh for quite a while for a few hours it's very expensive it's like 1600 bucks they have some sales but with the shipping and everything is still expensive you can rent it but it's still expensive because it's like a hundred something 130 140 per month but you also have to pay for shipping and for cleaning uh which brings it even if you rent it for three four months it's like 600 700 bucks so what i did i just bought the used one on offer up which one was in good condition it came with like three sides of uh, swaddle and came with a sheet so I bought it for 800 bucks and when I'm done using it, I'm probably going to sell it for 800 bucks because from what I noticed, they don't really lose their value uh, much. So this is my plan because again, I'm nowhere near to be rich right now. So this is how I deal with the situation. Okay, so the next category is the baby bathing basically. So my favorite shampoo and body wash is this one by baby Ganix, baby Janix, I don't know how to pronounce it. I absolutely love that this is like a foaming formula. This is just my personal preference because I feel like it's very soft on the baby's uh, skin and on the hair. So this is my favorite. So the next item is actually uh, a baby bath. So the one that I'm using is this, I think it's called Puj, 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 I don't know. P-U-J, basically this is what it is. This is, it folds like this so you can hang it. It has like, like a little something to hang. So you put it in your um, in your sink, especially if you live in a smaller place like me. I live in a condo. So this is the compact version. It's like a portable one. And I have a little bit of a bigger version as well that folds differently. So we've been liking this one. So I only have a few items to talk to you about. So this is the hatch. Um, sound machine it has the night night light of different colors you can program it connect it to your phone it has different sounds as well um, so I use one for my twins and I use one for the baby so it kind of helps the baby sleep through all the noises that are going on in you know next door basically my uh, twins are very loud and uh, the sound machine uh, helps my baby to sleep through all the noises so another thing that you definitely will need for your baby is the bottle warmer. 
uh, just because sometimes I pump and I leave the bottle in the fridge for my husband so he can easily warm it up for the baby so um, my favorite is this baby Brezza because you can select different uh, settings if the bottle is cold or if it's a room temperature you can select how many ounces it is so it warms up um, like appropriately basically it's not just one time fits all and another baby Brezza item that has like a heavy usage in our house I use it like at least 10 times a day so this is a baby Brezza sterilizer they have a different model uh, like an advanced pro something so I have this model specifically and I love it because you can either sterilize and dry you can dry or you can only sterilize so depending on the amount of time that you have you can choose 30 minutes 45 and 60 so um, I don't have to get like a baby bottle or rack and put it on the counter I wash the bottles and I would just put it right here or the uh, parts from the pump that I'm using so this has been very helpful as well and the last item I would like to talk to you about is the stroller um, I told you before that I've been using Duna stroller for a very long time we had two of them for um, for our twins they're very pricey they're about 500 bucks each but again they don't lose their value I remember I sold one of them for like 250 bucks after I was done using them um, and I kept one just in case we have another baby and we did so this is how it looks it's like a stroller right now and you can fold this wheels and it will become um, like a car seat that you just put in the base or you can even use it in your car without the base and just put the seat belt over it they have this little canopy i've been definitely um using this a lot with all of my kids and that is it guys for today's video thank you so much for tuning in i really appreciate you watching this whole video please give me a thumbs up if you would like to see more videos like this i'm planning to make another like essential or like a favorite videos for um three to six months old babies but this is the items that i'm using the most and i'm loving them right now so yeah i hope you found this video helpful uh please give me a thumbs up please subscribe to my channel and until the next time i will see you guys soon bye